Hello everybody, this is the Stockshaw's Guide and today we're talking about a unique hybrid cable state suspension bridge system in Chicago. It is called the North Avenue Bridge and spans east-west just north of Goose Island. In 1877, a central pier swing bridge was built and then replaced in 1907 by a drawbridge as the industrial river traffic below the bridge decreased while the automobile traffic running over the bridge jumped drastically. This aging drawbridge was no longer in an acceptable condition as it needed substantial maintenance and repairs and hence this hybrid bridge was built. This bridge is a fixed span hybrid suspension cable state bridge of the same height but almost twice as long in length. The new bridge has four lanes spread sidewalks helping to reduce the congestion caused by the 40,000 cars a day that travel over the bridge. Here are some quick facts about the bridge. It has a span of 420 feet, a width of 78.5 feet, a total height to the top of the pylons of 72 feet and a vertical clearance of 18 feet as required by the United States Coast Guard. The bridge took 22 months to complete from June 2006 to May 2008 and costed about 25 million US dollars. One design constraint was the presence of the railroad line that used to run along the eastern bank of the river. Another design consideration was the desire to have a clear view to the Chicago skyline to make crossing the bridge visually pleasing. A hybrid structure system was selected to meet various geometric and clearance constraints we just discussed. Also, due to the rising cost of steel, the construction of a new drawbridge was ignored. The length of the crossing was too short for a pure suspension bridge, while a pure cable straight bridge would require a larger towers than desired for the site. As a result, engineers chose this hybrid cable straight suspension bridge. The bridge consists of three segments, a 252-foot main span and two 48-foot approach spans. The middle portion of the center span over the bridge will be supported by suspension cables and hangers and the remainder of the center section and the east and west approach spans will be supported by cable stays, a total of 24 cables arranged in a fan configuration. Both systems share two sets of 67 foot tall pylons which rise 50 feet above the deck. The pylons, each weighing approximately 95,000 pounds, are extremely complex since they are required to support the combined forces of the suspension and cable state systems. Each pylon foundation is supported by 10 micro piles extending 90 feet into the bedrock. This hybrid bridge system is the first and only of its type to be built in Chicago. It is a design divergence from all the draw bridges that fill up Chicago. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something from it. See you next time!